Hey, brother. Oh, brother. 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 These videos are satirical views. You don't have to agree, but don't bitch about it. I hate this channel. This is where I put a trophy. If I had one! Wow, you're a Hogan hater, still bitching and crying 30 years later. Get over it already. Can't change history. Yeah, he did shady things, so have other wrestlers, but you always want to pick on Hogan. Cry me a river. Well, um, I don't know why I'd cry you a river, because you're already working on two waterfalls yourself, because I said I didn't like your hero. Oh, Ramon, how are you gonna live with yourself now? I don't like Hogan. <laughs> no one's bitching about anything. I made a video, guys. That's what I do. I make videos. I make videos on wrestling topics, usually. That's what I did. I wasn't like, oh, man, Hogan used his power. And Hogan shot. He, he was a despicable human being. You would think that I said that we should hang Hogan. Like, like, this is insane. No one's bitching about it. The only people bitching are you in the comments because I won't think like you. Be like me. Ugh. Be like me. Be like me. I'm not like you. I don't want to be like you. I'm not like you. Yeah, he did shady things to all other wrestlers, but you always want to pick on Hogan. Yeah, guess what? I also picked on Shawn Michaels the, the same week. The same week. God damn. I swear, you know, I swear, y'all just want me to make more fan mail videos. That's what it is. That's what it is. Y'all just want me to sit down, not have a script ready, read your comments, and then comment on them. That's what you want. And I'm happy to oblige. Why not? Still got 46 more videos to make for 2020. God damn. Social injustice warrior. He's always hating on Hogan. It's like he's obsessed, LOL. I made a video on Hulk Hogan called The Height of Hulkamania, where I went through his entire career in the WWF the first time around and the beginning stages of his WCW career. And in it, I said, I didn't really care for Hulk Hogan. Didn't say anything bad about the guy. I'm talking nice because I'm trying to... I'm trying to show you that there's no anger here. But I didn't say anything bad about Hogan. I didn't say I hated Hogan. I just said, eh, I didn't really like him. Wasn't really my thing. Wasn't my cup of tea. Now, the reason I made those videos is because it was the chronological next step in the NWO series I was making. See, I had to make that so I could lead into the NWO series. That was, that was the point of it. That's why I made that video. And this time around, I made this video because it started off with a Shawn Michaels video being a politicker, then it went to Hulk Hogan being a politicker, and then the third video is Shawn Michaels versus Hulk Hogan. So again, I made this video because chronologically it made sense. Me having a different opinion than you somehow means that I'm obsessed. Yeah, I'm, I'm upset. Yo, I have, I, have, I have a dartboard right here at the house, right behind my mic stand, of Hulk Hogan's face on it, and man, I always, I always try to just hit him right in between his red and yellow. What type of shit is this? Hogan is the greatest of all time, and that's not up for debate. I am slowly losing faith in humanity. And by slowly, I mean rapidly. Wow, you're pathetic with your bullshit fake reporting. Oh shit, guys, you heard it here. I'm fake news. Fake news, you heard it. This channel's fake. Everybody unsubscribe and immediately get me a job at CNN because that's what I am. I am fake news. Listen, Jesse, can I call you Jess? I just want to let you know, in life, you're going to hear things you don't like, right? You're going to hear facts that you don't like. It doesn't change them from being facts. You not liking them, them not voting with your reality, doesn't change the fact that that's real. That shit happened. There's no fake reporting here. This shit happened. It's documented. Somebody else said you can't change history. You can't. I'm just talking about it. It's like this. This is like if, if in the middle 
uh, of like a social studies class. Like, like some kid stood up and said, oh, you know what? I don't think Germany really did all of that stuff. You know, that that's just not true. What kind of bullshit is this? You are an effing mark. Oh, boy. Wow. Somebody. Somebody. Somebody needs to call this kid's parents. Because you don't report real news. You go by bullshit Dave Meltzer and Wade Keller bullshit. You don't report on real news. You don't get your facts straight. You're nothing but a hater. And you waste people's time with your bullshit. If it wasn't for Hulk Hogan, you wouldn't have anything fake to report and make up excuses to hate on the man. I'll be waiting for your bullshit fake reply. And this is why we don't let children get involved in politics. Jesse, once again... Just because you don't like a fact doesn't change it from being a fact. You know what? I'll give you an example, right? Just off the top of my head. I don't like the fact that we're all going to die. Especially me. I'm not really fond of that. I don't like thinking that, oh, it's going to be the end soon. I'm just going to, you know, boom, that's it. Gone. DOA. RIP. Some other kind of abbreviation. You know, I'm not really fond of that. It doesn't change the fact that we're still all going to die. You, me, Hulk Hogan, gonna die. It's gonna happen. Doesn't change it. Also, I don't think I've ever, ever reported on anything that Dave Meltzer or Wade Keller's reported on. This is, again, factual. This, this actually happened. I, I fucking love a crybaby hater. Go cry for life, honey. Aw, it's, it's so sad. They probably thought that that was clever. Everyone press F for respects in the comments. Poor Hogan haters still crying. I really like that these comments have taken this as reflective of me being a Hogan hater. When all I did was literally list a bunch of times in which Macho Man's title wins were secondary to Hulk Hogan being Hulk Hogan. You know what? You guys are right. From now on, I'm, go I'm gonna make positive videos about Hulk Hogan. That's not how I feel about him, but like, you guys are right. I don't want to be a Hogan hater. Still crying. Still crying. All I said was, I'm not really a fan of the guy. And also, here's something that, you know, happened in his career. And you all are losing your goddamn minds, going ape shit in the comments, coming to White Knight for somebody who's not even being attacked. But I'm the one who's crying. I'm the one who's crying. You can't handle that somebody doesn't think the same way that you do, but you're right. I'm the one that's crying. Just a reminder, Hulk Hogan achieved and did more make a wish list stuff and more for charities than the maker of this video. Who's full of shit now? Okay. 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 Yeah. No, no, no. Okay. All right. No, okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. What the hell does that have to do with anything? Uh, I, I never had to break out the loudspeaker before. Never had to do that. Yes. Hulk Hogan did more for make a wish foundations than I have. What, 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 is, what is your point? What, what is the point? That, that, again, that's like being in history class. And, 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 and you're learning about the Holocaust. And then somebody goes, uh, actually, Hitler was a phenomenal painter. And apparently, I, I've heard he was great at interpretive dance. Holocaust still happened. What does that have to do with anything? What you just said. What, what, what you said is factual. But, but what, what was the point that you thought you made? I said Macho's wins came secondary to Hulk Hogan hot dogging and grandstanding. And you were like, well, Hulk Hogan has done more for sick people than you have. What does it have to do? What's the correlation? Where do you could, just I just want you to backtrack for a second. Uh, what's your name? Bushman. Oh, great name. Bushman, backtrack for a second. And you let me know when you found the point that you were trying to make. You let you let me know. Let me know where it's at, all right? I, I would love to see it once you've made it. Oh, God. I said somebody else wrote me a novel. This, this guy w wrote me a uh, fucking book series here. Here's the point every Hogan hater misses. If it wasn't for Hulk Hogan, the stage Macho Man was getting over on wouldn't have existed. The rocket ship that Vince... You know, I'm just... Who, what's the point? You know, what, what, really, what's the point anymore? I'm, they don't have any points. I said something happened, and, the, and these people responded by, whoa, oh, 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 no, no, you're wrong. Hogan's the best. Hogan's the greatest. Hogan, I'm What 
the fuck is your point? Hulk Hogan was, and still is, the greatest wrestling star ever. All those wrestlers bitching were just jealous. It's sad how he's getting so much hate. I'm afraid it won't end until the day he dies. So you mean to tell me that the people who shared a locker room with him, who said that he was an ego-driven, delusional maniac, are lying? They're all just jealous? So, okay, that's interesting. Uh, hey, what's your... Oh, God, I don't, I'm not even going to try to say that name. All right, so... so Tell me, what's your viewpoint on Hulk Hogan and the fact that he's lied about so much of his past? Including saying that he uh, was about to play bass for Metallica, uh, saying that Elvis Presley was a Hulkamaniac, saying that he outdrank Jim Belushi after... I'm um, not uh, John Belushi, Jesus Christ. John Belushi at WrestleMania 3. Uh, and all this being fictitious. Or, hey, how about that one video? How about that one video where he's like, Yeah, I, uh... These boots, I, I, I wrestled Andre the Giant in them, and then he died a few days after. Andre died like two years after WrestleMania 3. The most famous boots of all time. I wrestled Andre the Giant with these boots on, and then a couple days later, he passed on. Probably more. Probably more. I'm probably off on that. But not nearly as off as Hogan was, who thinks that he big booted the Giant, and the next day he fell down dead. Tell me. Tell me more about, about how you feel about that. Is, is Hogan just jealous of Hogan, too? Is that, is that what's going on there? All this stuff in wrestling didn't happen to me, right? Hogan didn't screw me over. Hogan never, Hogan never at any point in time put himself over me, you know, or, or anybody that I know and love. So I don't care. I'm not really that passionate about it. I made a video on a subject in wrestling because I make videos on subjects in wrestling. Hey, you know, it's not that deep. Well, let me tell you something, brother. You're watching the Social Injustice Warrior V Infuso's channel, dude. So if you like the words that came out of his mouth hole, and you too want to become a V-tard, don't forget to like and subscribe, and click that little bell icon to get updates and notifications. Ooh, tell him what up, Mach. Ooh, yeah. Follow the man on Twitter, yeah, because we all know it's not stalking if it's on the internet, yeah. Join the madness by joining the Discord, and if you have a moment of time and a free dollar to spare, head over to the SIJW's Patreon, dig it, where you can request videos, get exclusive videos, and early access to content. Yeah. Or go down to PayPal, where you can buy the shirts, brother. But most importantly, just remember, if you're not tuning in, then, then you're, you're missing, missing out. out.